Walking around Sevilla Pueblo is unlike anything else. It's this amazing, beautiful sort of emptiness. There's still a presence there. You can really feel that it was thriving and teeming with life at one point. It's really important to preserve these cultures, these people, these stories. Once it's gone, it's gone. New Mexico is called the land of enchantment. It goes back to the sort of mythopoetic origins of the Spanish coming over and these fantasies about the new world and how the new world would be rich in these resources and minerals. What they found here was a magical landscape that changes quickly. You kind of think to yourself, how is this possible? At the beginning of 2023, I proposed a project to digitally scan and render 3D models of historic sites around New Mexico, but we were missing the technology specifically. About halfway into the year, I heard from Jenna Van Brashot at Northrop Grumman wanting to pursue the same kind of project, and it was the perfect matchup. Being a research scientist at Northrop Grumman is different every single day. The work that we do with technology for conservation often mirrors the work that we're doing behind closed doors. And so to be able to apply some of that high level technology to conservation efforts is really what we're all about. We had an idea and we came to Bethany and she had a vision. The Baltimore team came to Albuquerque, New Mexico, specifically to Sevilleta. They used a drone as well as a LiDAR scanner. It's often hard with sites like Sevilleta for us to be able to see where there was, for example, the Spanish Mission Pueblo. And because we're getting the difference between the elevation of the ground, we can see what was there. They then pulled the data from those scans and created point clouds as well as a 3D model of the site. It feels good to be in Sevilleta. You know that there is a rich culture around you and you can't necessarily see it. That's why these LiDAR scans are so exciting. There definitely is an urgency to this effort. Climate change is posing a massive risk to a lot of the historic sites. As these adobe buildings are eroding, the history is also disappearing with them. Future generations need these materials in order to connect with their past. The collaboration within our team has been really phenomenal. We've been able to share ideas with each other, brainstorm solutions. This project makes an impact because we get to use the technology, the hardware, the software that we have here at Northrop Grumman with programs that oftentimes don't have access. Technology can be integrated in useful ways in humanities research. It was through that partnership with Bethany and, and hearing her vision, not only of how we might capture these sites, but then how we're gonna share these captures with the public that really brought this project to life. This project has been constantly surprising. It was surprising to get a call from Jenna and her team at North of Grumman. It was surprising to discover all these new sites. You keep digging through these historical narratives and it's such an enriching place to be because your, your mind is always stimulated, your imagination is always stimulated. Here in Albuquerque, we have a really special group of people who enjoy working together. They're all so clever, they're so creative, and so being able to leverage that creative energy and expertise has been a real dream.